President Obama briefly met his Venezuelan counterpart for the first time on the margins of the summit. Greatly exceeding his allotted time in his speech, Nicolas Maduro lashed out at the U.S. and its leader and said relations could only be normalized if sanctions against officials were lifted. But their face-to-face -face meeting was less hostile by all accounts. The Venezuelan leader said it was a serious and sincere encounter. We told the truth, and I would say it was cordial. In the past few weeks, the U.S. has described Venezuela as a security threat and imposed sanctions on seven top officials, accusing them of violence or human rights abuses. At an alternative people's summit in Panama, Maduro's revolutionary rhetoric was back. But he's commended Obama for saying the U.S. did not see Venezuela as a threat, despite the designation to the contrary by Washington. U.S. officials had tried to downplay the accusation, but it clearly rankled with several Latin American leaders.